Hey everybody, Lou from RV Habit. I'm here at the 2022 Tampa RV Florida Super Show and I'm looking at a Jayco J Flight. I'll give you the model number in a minute on the door. But let's start out here. It comes with a uh, power tongue jack, your dual propane. The other side only has uh, a storage uh, compartment and it's really tight to get to, so we're going to skip that. But we'll start here. And if you look here, this is pass through storage. It goes all the way to the other side and you can access it from both the passenger side and the driver's side of the vehicle. Uh, kind of almost like a fifth wheeler. It comes with a Solera power awning. It has the nice uh, more ride steps, those solid steps to get into it. Really nicely done. The aluminum siding. And if you come down, your typical 110 outlets here, a TV mount, your cable antenna and satellite input, your fresh water fill, back of your furnace, and this unit I like because it has an outdoor kitchen with the pass-through storage, a small sink, a drawer, and a little fridge. And on the back of the unit is a spare tire and the back of your water heater and your 30 amp service. Let's go on in. Uh, if you go right to your right, as soon as you walk in, you'll see mom and dad's bed and it has two wardrobe closets. Come on over here. You can hang here and it, it's very deep. You can see how deep it is all the way back, but uh, it has hanging. Got a nice bed here. And you have storage. Look at all the storage under this bed. Really amazing. And you got outlets on both sides and 12 volt on both sides. Two windows, ducted air condition. And let's go to the kitchen. Nice double bowl sink, nice countertop. I don't know what kind of surface it is, just a hard surface. It's not pure Korean or anything. You have a uh, Furion stove, three burner, LPG with an oven. Your power center's below. You have a, a microwave on top with a vent down below you actually it's small but you actually have a spot for a garbage can i always look for that because a lot of rvs there's no place to put the garbage can and this one actually has it a couple drawers here all wood drawers the heat is on the sides so it's not on the floor always look for that i hate the vents on the floor and this, you're seeing this almost in all the rigs uh, this year is they're, they're moving to 12 volt refrigerators, no more LPG electrics. A lot, a lot of units have these 12 volts. Uh, and what's cool about this is double bunk beds and they're big, they're not small bunk beds. You can be very comfortable up there. And coming in here, look how spacious this bathroom is. I'm gonna even sneak in here. Look how big this shower is. That's actually bigger than the one in my house. I mean, it is really, really big. Probably three feet by three feet. Plenty of room. I'm 5'10", but I mean, there's a ton of room in here. Small sink. The only thing I, again, I don't like Plastic toilet, they should upgrade that to a China toilet and this would be uh, a perfect unit. And the last thing we'll look at over here on the side is you have your U-shaped dinette and you could, if you have kids, I mean, you could sit five comfortably here easily. And this actually comes into a bed and there's more storage under both of them. And finally, you have your main wall unit. Here's for where your TV would go. This is your uh, radio and more storage underneath and room for a DVD player if you want it. But again, this is the Jayco 242BHS and the show price is $32,995. Usually it's $41,669. But really, very, very nicely done, very well decorated and uh, the quality seems pretty good, actually. You know, nothing's falling apart. I don't see any nails popping or anything, so the quality is really good. So again, it's the Jayco 242 bunkhouse model. I'm Lou from RV Habit. Thanks for watching.